It is, of course, the uh, senior school girls. A somewhat smaller field, but definitely a very much a quality field. Yes, it is, Harry. Although the numbers are down, the competitors are as follows. Gabriella Arnold, Taylor Ashley Bean, Renee Mabry, Raquel Fox, Shante Hendrickson, Karen Miners, Megan Berry, and Kaylee Hook from the United States that rounds up the field. The record set last year of 522 by Kaylee Hook. We have a small field, but they're about to get underway. It's officially underway. Taylor Ashley Bean is the favorite. She's been to the first ever Junior Olympics and did extremely well, but you can't count out Gabriella Arnold, one of the island's top triathletes also, who's very much in the mix. Other competitors being Rainey Mabry, uh, Rachel Fox, Shante Hendrickson, Cameron Miners, Megan Berry, and the defending champion, Kaylee Hook. And they're just rounding the birdcage on the way down. We have competitors from the fifth race of the night for the 2011 KPMG Miles, the senior school girls approaching the quarter mile mark, 118 on the come. clock. Oh, they're very closely bunched together. This is still anybody's race. All of them are pacing themselves. Very close race indeed. And they are all very much together. I would say probably 10 meters or less separating all of the competitors there. Taylor, Taylor Ashley Bean, As the they came. Uh, favorite. Uh, was uh, running to shoulder to shoulder with two other competitors. And we'll see what happens there. Very interesting race. We're going to see how it unfolds. Okay, so definitely more of a technical race, I'd say. Uh, Rachel Fox running third, looking extremely comfortable. Uh, but looks like. Ellie has decided she's going to be the one to beat. She's hanging up in front here, looking strong. Taylor is looking like she's struggling a bit, but you never know with Taylor. Sometimes she doesn't look as relaxed as some on us look, but at the end, she's right there. Rachel Fox looking extremely comfortable in her long black tight. Heading back a little bit. We look like we've got Ashley having a good run. Uh, sorry, Megan there, not Ashley. Megan's looking comfortable. Megan had such a good year last year, but she looks a bit stronger right now. She looks comfortable running in third place there. It'll be interesting to see if she hangs in there at the end. Chante is looking strong, running in fourth. Gabriella Arnold's there. Arnold's taking third place now. Followed closely by Shanti Hendrickson. Still leading. Kaylee Hope. The Californian lady. Followed by Taylor Ashley Bean. Some um, five meters behind. Hook's looking strong at this point. She stepped it up. Took by ten. Ashley. Followed by Shante Hendricks by some 30 meters. It's hook all the way. Hook's opened up the lead to some 20 meters now, maybe 25 even. Yeah, Ashley's fading. 
Brooks stepping it up. He's opening it up by some 40 meters at this point. Looks to be Shante and has to be Gabriel Arano in the background. Hard to see at this point. Just the ball back. Daily Hook surging again. It's hooked by almost 75 meters at this point. Ted Aspie looks to be struggling a bit. And some 75 meters behind her is the rest of the field. Most likely Shante Hendrick. We are now moments away from the finish of race number five, the senior school girls, and it looks to be a repeat for Kaylee Hook of the United States. Last year, her time, 5.22. It's going to be close this year. 5.18 from Kaylee Hook. Here she comes in 5.23 unofficially. What a run. Successfully defending her title, running away with this one is Kaylee Hook. And Taylor Ashley Bean uh, will take second place honors. Here comes Ashley Bean, 540, 543, 544. Followed very closely there by Rachel Fox, who will take the bronze. Here's number 102 also, Renai Mabry. 104, Shante Hendrickson. 106, Megan Berry. And there's two more competitors on the course. We're looking at just over six minutes now. And the final two competitors of race number five. Here they come, 100 and 105. 100, Gabriella Arno, and 105 being Cameron Miners. Girls race, uh, Taylor Ashley Bean will be the official first place finisher. Taylor Ashley Bean, of course, a repeat winner and from Warwick Academy. Congratulations. Welcome. You said you really like Bermuda. Tell us more. I love it here. It's my favorite race of the whole year. It's the most exciting one. Last year you were in 522, 523 this year. You're still in great shape. So what's the secret? Run hard and run fast. Train hard. And your training's been going extremely well. Where do you reside in the United States exactly? What? Where do you reside? Uh, Where do you live? Okay, Templeton, California. Okay, well, welcome back. And congratulations again coming back to defend. Thank you very much. Thank you, Larry. Uh, we are indeed honored to have tonight with us uh, Premier the Honorable Paula Cox, who will present the medals to the senior school girls. We're very pleased to have you here, Premier. Obviously a sign of your inclusive leadership, for which we're all very grateful. So if we could start with third place, first of all, in a time of 549.4. Oh, I beg your pardon. We're going to start with Kaylee Hook, who, of course, is our visitor from California. Big round of applause, please, for Kaylee. And in third place, we have Rach Rainy Mabry. Well done, Rainy. And in second place, we have Rachel Fox, time of 5.49.4. But our local winner, repeat winner from Warwick Academy in a time of 5.45.1, we have Taylor Ashley Bean. Any quick thoughts you'd like to share with us? Congratulations. Um, I want to say congratulations to everybody who has a good race, who has new handouts, and I just want to wish Shaquille a good luck. He's running right now. You heard that. Congratulations, Well ladies. done, ladies. Well done. 
We're speaking now with Debbie Salters as we've spoken to some of the former presidents. Debbie, on behalf of what we call, who we call Mama Lake, uh, this, is a, this is a special event. Um, yes, this is the first year that she would have missed due to her uh, untimely passing. She was involved from the time Clive Long started this, and it looks like the banner is being passed because she was always out Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, I helped her, but now um, I'm trying to see if somebody else might want to do it, but they're not having that. But I'm prepared to carry it on until somebody else comes along and says, I'll take it from you. And I know she's going to be a big miss this year. Thanks.